featuring Indie Falcon. Any, any, any serious thoughts as to who the killer is? We're back <laughs> this early in the game. What? Any thoughts to who the killer is? Um, probably... I already know who it is. Well, we've, you know, watched other people play this presumably on some LP or other. Yeah. I wasn't gonna play this. My thing. dick is over an inch now! I played, I played Indigo Prophecy. I did my time. <laughs> um, no, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna vote that it's, uh, this guy. Take long. Jaden? Yeah. Do take you think long it's gonna what? take long? Oh. No. Dang, it's gonna take long! <laughs> Take a long goose. Am I putting on my... Put on your future glasses. Sunglasses. It's because the lights are so bright like my future. Yeah, that's not conspicuous at all. What am I doing? Is this like my digital workspace? Let's play with tanks! Play... Baseball. What the fuck is happening? Oh, I'm just passing the time by playing with a federal agency investigation tool. Right on. You don't look like a crazy person to everyone else at all. <laughs> like this guy just slamming his hands. What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> like, ah! Uh, the fuck is this? That that guy's like, I really, what? I don't know what to tell this man. <laughs> Prompt button. to look bored. <laughs> Jaden and me. Just We're fidget because I'm having the DTs. Dang, I will like Man, to I go for some drugs patient. right now. Well, might as well keep playing with my balls. Yeah, 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 yeah. You need to play with the tank. I don't get to pick. It's always the ball. What? What's the point? Yeah. Just keep that up, I guess. Oh. Up. I'm off, Charlene. I'll look at the reports later. I'll cancel all appointments for this Party. afternoon. Okay. Oh, Captain. <laughs> Agent Norman J. I just said cancel! Ugh, <sighs> fine. Jane Fuck do you want? Of course, we've been expecting you. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Do you mind tagging along? I do mind, actually. As we walk? Yeah, of course. I wanted um, to, I wanted to tell him I mind. Started, but, uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, 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 it's fine. We have them every day now. Believe me, it's not always easy finding something to tell them. Fortunately, today we have some news. Goodbye. <laughs> I've decided I don't want to talk to you anymore. Lieutenant Blake Kett. Yeah, we met this morning. Was that in the morning? He has his own methods, but he's a good cop, I'm sure. Where am I? There we go. What's up? to tie a knot in the necktie. Sure. I guess. Want me to tie your tie for you? This is a little gay, sir. The FBI on this one, but the he just wants me to do his work for him. Origami killer case crept up on us, and it's fast becoming a national concern. He has a huge boner right now. He just gets off on having other men tie his ties. No, this guy <laughs> is exotic. These flowers and origami. <laughs> I like how Jaden's probably not listening to any of these. It's like <laughs> over, <laughs> under, <laughs> I know I'm not listening. I'm here to arrest a serial killer. With all due respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. I don't fucking care. That was creepy. No. Of course not. All I'm asking is that you make progress. And fast. The press want a perpetrator. And we're gonna have to serve him up on a silver platter. Will do. Quiet, Irene! <laughs> I can see your bald spots, Go sir. Go see and she'll show you to your office. I have my own Take office, you know, yay. If you're interested. It'll give you an idea of the political... An idea. Around here. Thank you, sir. Welcome to the club, Jaden. I don't want to be in this club. I look like Ethan's brother. I don't want to quit. Mmm, <laughs> woohoo. Can I put on my sunglasses? No. Lane. What is the point of you? Well, who's Charlene? Where's my office? Sir, are you Charlene? Sir. Where's my office, sir? Sir? Help, I'm lost. I don't know where I am. You can go back to that room or that woman. Yeah, hey, I'm gonna... Oh, what? Who? Can I punch somebody? Can I punch somebody who's being interrogated? Yeah, I hope. Just I hope like I the guess. FBI would have done in real life. Corner. This way? Over here? I'm here to make sure that everything's running up to FBS standards. Not enough electrocution. Um, why would you lie to me? 
Never mind. I was wrong. As usual. Just taking a nappy nap. Is that my office? Going to sleep. So, bitch. All women are bitches. Love, John Cage. I'm sure it's, he never said anything like that. Cage. Watch. Nice watch. Oh. I wanted to watch oh, her. the present we offer to our new lieutenants. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time, and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like. We're still a few dollars short. Um, um yeah. sure. Congratulate Larry on my behalf. I'll be sure to do that, sir. What's up? What's up? Where's my office? Captain oh, Perry it looked like I was, it was following that woman. Yes, Follow me. Just to cost random passers-by. Where's my office? I don't even know you. Who are you? This way, that way. Where's my gun? Is that virtual too? Like my everything else that my glasses do? Do I shoot lasers? <laughs> Thank you. What a dump. It's so well lit. Yes, this, beautiful. This is my office? At least you get an office, asshole. Slam. If you need anything, you know where to find me. <laughs> nice brooch. God, this place sucks. What are you talking about? It's awesome. It's cozy. Why losers? Time to work. Time to wake. Time to take a seat. Anything else I can do in here before I sit? What's the... There we are. Can I look through old files or look at Robin Williams pinned up on the billboard? No. I guess we'll have a sit. Good thing I brought my workspace with me. It's in my sunglasses. Really? God. Fuck this office! I hate this place! Am I gonna have like a, a virtual desk too? I just sit down in the chair and everything's virtual. Oh. I just wanted it up against the wall. I guess so. Feng Shui. Fucking weirdo. Let's have some thoughts. This investigation is starting to give me the creeps. Get a hold of yourself, man. You need to do some bright blue drugs. No time to lose. Gotta get down to work. First, analyze the case files. The case is front page news in all the papers. It's not gonna be easy investigating a crime under the glare of all this publicity. Sure it will, just ignore wow. them. More like a big cupboard. Well, I wanted a quiet place to work, and it certainly looks like I got it. Do right. my drugs. Time to sunglasses. Yeah. Pick your desktop theme. <laughs> Time to play Step solitaire. One. Change the office. Into my office. Now which desktop theme would you like? Would you like autumn? Would you like space? space? Or would you like clouds? Cloud. Let's go with clouds. I know I like rock. to work on a cliff. Gives my desktop publishing office a sense of, you know, urgency. Clues. Well, well. Looks like there's something new. Your accent is really muddled. Uh, it's because he's a Frenchman pretending to have, like, a weird Brooklyn accent. Mm. Harry, comment. Tire tracks on the side of the road behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car. The killer's car is probably a Chevrolet Malibu 83. Assuming those tracks were the killer's car. Well then. Just one oh, well, army store in town. You don't think he could have fucking just made it himself like a, you know... Normal person. People have specialized origami stores? They do in the future! Yeah, this future is so weird. It's got future glasses, but everybody drives cars from the 80s. Who fucking knows? Now we're gonna be... What is this? Water? 
We're in the We're underwater. underwater. That's it. That's the office. That's the dream. I always wanted to be a scuba diver, but I'm I think just it would be a detective really instead. easy to get addicted to this nonsense. Don't you think? Yeah. Files. Why do you digitally file things like a file cabinet? What a weirdo. Eight victims in the last three years. All boys, age between nine and thirteen. He probably didn't do anything bad to them besides kill them. No signs of violence. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. No one notices anything. 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 Bodies are found three to five days later. Later. Drowned. Do you see where I can hear the, like, bad Christopher Walken impression? Yeah, no, I hear it too. Analyze. Analyze. And- adjacent to where the bodies are found. <laughs> and all the victims disappeared in the fall. Killer has a large comfort zone. He gained confidence rapidly and moved away from his base. Hmm, this won't make the geo profiling any easier. I do all this police investigation. An origami in the hand, an orchid on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found, which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. Over 3,500 people it's, it's kind of funny you're doing this. You're like, I'll have an underwater <laughs> office for these drowning victims. <laughs> it helps me get in the mind of the killer. The killer is white, aged between 30 and 45. He is intelligent, calm, and determined. An organized type. He has a car... He's probably employed, but his work allows him free time. Man, Lane, back to my shitty office. Now it's time for the DTs! I've spent too much time in my awesome virtual world. I need drugs. Oh no, my drugs! Going into withdrawal is the worst, right? You're not looking so good. I'm ready to go wash my face. Is that a... Euphemism. Whoops. There we go. Am I gonna fall down? I need to take some. I'm gonna faint if I resist. I bet you just resist it and then faint a bunch and then eventually you'll be over it. Whoa. Yeah! No this won't be suspicious. Man disappears into quiet corner office, comes out all stumbling. I found this bottle back here. Nope. Not taking it. Haha. <laughs> just gonna pass out. I think I'd actually. <laughs> Is everything all right, sir? Yeah, I'm fine. No problem. No one. No one must see. No one must see the true me. I'll explode out of my flesh. Quick before the bone thief inside me explodes out of my flesh suit. In we go. Time to faint. Wouldn't it, wouldn't it have made more sense to faint in my office? Why am I a drug addict? What have I done? No one really knows. Um. Um. Like this woman is confirmed to be, to be like ghost. An artsy shot, but it's really funny when people <laughs> just walk through each other. Nope, she's a ghost. Hey, am yeah, I gonna be me now? Cause the other me fainted. What's up? What's up, douchebag? I think you have a, a passed out drug addict in your women's bathroom. You might want to go check that out. This is Lieutenant Blake, Mister Marsh. Could you please tell him what happened? It, it was this afternoon. I went to the park with my son, Sean. We played together for a while. And then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden carousel. horses. Carousel? And when I turned back, Sean had disappeared. 
Exactly what time did you arrive at the park? Try to remember exactly, Mr. Mars. Every detail can be important. <laughs> what was he wearing? Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, clothes? Man, I don't fucking know. Like, I give a shit. 4.15. Yeah, that's it, 4.15. I remember exactly, because I looked at the clock in the park when we arrived. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? He was wearing a coat. Yeah. I don't give a shit, beige. A beige coat. Not gonna find him pants. alive. Everyone's gonna be dead. Black pants, for sure. Black pants. How could Sean have disappeared without you even noticing? Weren't you right by the carousel? Your hands Why is giant. it gonna say carousel weird? Little walk, stay carousel, stay on bench, can't remember. I... I can't remember exactly. It all happened so fast. You say you took your son to the park after school. But you didn't report him missing until 8.15. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? Because I blacked out. Where's the blacked out button? I... I don't know. I panicked. I didn't know what to do. Did Sean have any particular difficulties, Mr. Mars? Anything that might have caused him to run away? You're awfully calm all of a sudden. Did you take your drugs? <laughs> Where did you come from? Sean is all the decisions I make are going to make sure I f don't find my son and he's fucking oh, dead. <laughs> and then I get shot at the end. Difficult. Yay! Woo! I wish I cared, but I don't. Okay at school? I wonder if it reveals who the killer is if you don't get that far. Where did you come from? Weren't you just in the bathroom? What? Oh, that guy? Yeah, I don't know what he asked me. I don't care. <laughs> no, nothing in particular. As long as Fatty Arbuckle has a happy ending, right. that's all that matters to me. That's all the questions I have for now. You're free to go, Mr. Mars. We'll continue to look for Sean overnight. We'll contact you if we have any more questions. Do... Do you think the origami killer... Obviously I do. Come on, man. Your son's fucking dead. Listen. Bye. Your son's probably just run off and I'll turn up in a couple hours. But what if it is the origami killer? But what if it is the origami <laughs> killer? And we have about four days to find him alive. <laughs> Bye. Later. Aw, oh, man. Oh, no. Not my son. Jason? Was that is that the one? Whatever one starts with an S. S Sam? Is that my awesome wife who I'm Did super in love something? with totally? No, nothing yet. But they're gonna keep looking through the night. This is the second time you've lost one of our children. You're kind of an ass. You're the worst. It, it, it's still too early to say. But it is a possibility. Worst father ever. What happened, Ethan? How could you lose Sean like that? You should never have taken You're not gonna mention that you blacked him. out? I mean, for God's sake, how hard is it to keep your eye on a child? <laughs> I think you even You think you learned your lesson last time? Why Come on, man. Even, I blacked out and now I don't Was remember that I blacked out. No. <laughs> I needed to lose both sons. I need to, to figure out how the first son even died. It's still a mystery. <laughs> Can I, like, walk away? This is boring. <laughs> You're annoying. You're boring me. Stop crying. Don't touch her. You're Shut the worst. Up. I wish that this game had humanized either of you so I cared. But oh, no. no. Fatty Sad Arbuckle robot. was the most humanized and I only spent 15 minutes with him. <laughs> well, see you later, this robot all, life. This is all very dramatic. I gotta feel my robot feelings. Fade to my robot feelings. <laughs> robot feelings initiated. Hey! hey! It's your best friend, hey, Fatty, Fatty Arbuckle. How you doing? How you doing? Super excited to see up your nose again. Oh, yes. So happy. <laughs> She's happy to see you. This watchy turns out to be like the killer or a scumbag or like he rapes dogs or something. <laughs> something horrible. And I'll have to be like, oh no. He's a dog rapist. The character I liked the most rapes dogs. Very sad. <laughs> <clears throat> Move slowly. Shaking a little bit. What? He was shaking a little bit. Oh, they said you're shaking a little bit. I was like, My Why? dick is 1.4 inches almost if I round up.
Yes, hello, I have arrived. Lily. Press Lily. up is to this, enter the scene. Is this that same day? Oh, I, I didn't pay attention to the day. Well, I hope so. It's Tuesday. My name's Scott but I don't remember what day his stuff happened. Uh, nice I'm neck crack. The case of the origami killer. Uh, I'd like to ask you a few questions. My son is dead, Mr. Shelby. Uh, I wonder if I could have, like, Save. wandered around and pretended to be shopping. <laughs> Save Sean, sympathize, persist! You may know something that could help save other people's lives. I was unable to save the life of my I don't care about son. anyone else. <laughs> I do not see how I could save the lives of other people. Wait. I also lost someone I loved. I know what you're feeling. Then you will understand that I do not wish to talk about it. No, I like talking about it. It's awesome. Let's when my wife got strangled more. by a parole. Oh, do you sell inhalers? I'm all out and at least I won't go away completely empty-handed. In the back of this door, to the right. Wait, what? Thank you. Aren't inhalers inhalers like are inhalers prescription? Prescription? What? I want to live this in this place? future where I don't have to go to the fucking hassle of going to the pharmacy every time I need a a hit <laughs> off my giant bong. It's an inhaler with what's called a respiration chamber, which is like this long tube to make sure that I'm inhaling it slowly enough that it works. In case you were wondering what I was referring to. No asthma not. spray. Asthma spray for all your asthma. Fits all. Good evening, sir. Oh, hey, it's a guy with a gun. I get to fight somebody again. That's what Scott Shelby does. He's I'm coming. I'm coming. Give me what you got in the registry. Don't fucking try anything. Open the registry, you dumb fuck. Put the money on the counter. I'm coming. Very Shit, you definitely what? Are you gonna open that fucking register or not? No, sir. You do not have the right to steal that money from me. I have worked very hard to earn it. No, oh, there are potato it. chips in the way. Why is your store so dirty? You're out of your fucking mind, man. You don't get it, do you? I'm gonna put the fuck. Whoops. Hey, you! Come I didn't here. realize it was a slow prompt. Can I go back? No, oh, well, fuck nah. it up. <laughs> I said, come here now! Don't move! Hands up! I like how your finger clips completely Put your fucking through the hands thing. Up They're up, dude. Uh, my name's Scott. What about you? <laughs> my name's Scott. What's, your name? What's your name? My name's Andrew. Why did you tell me this? Um. Look, it's not worth it. Put the gun down and just walk away. You giving me advice? I wish I had brained him. I didn't realize advice? it was a slow prompt. Whoops. Do you have anyone you care for in your life? <laughs> How are you feeling today? A family? Yeah. House? <laughs> a little girl. House? How how are you? I got a little girl. Her name now, is would Jessica. Jessica appreciate you robbing a store? Yeah. Oh, hey! <laughs> That's exactly the angle he's going. Ask yourself. <laughs> you and Fatty Arbuckle are, are a lot alike. You haven't done anything serious yet. Just leave. If you put the gun away, we'll forget about what just happened, and that will be the end. Just walk, just walk away. away. Serious? Shit, man! What the fuck do you think I'm doing here? Leaving. Don't panic. Let's just stay calm. Nobody here wants to hurt you. No, no, we're all just. Except for me, I was about to brain you. I didn't realize it was a slow right prompt. Here. My bad. <laughs> I would have knocked the shit out of you first opportunity. Be all fucking right. You don't really want to shoot anybody, do you? I'm sure we can find a way out of this mess, right? Nice try. For a second there, you almost had me believing all your shit. And now... Yeah! <laughs> Just walk up to him. What's up, dude? The blams. Pontrum. Pontrum! Yeah! <laughs> yeah, I hit him right in the- oh! One punch out cold! Man, Fatty Arbuckle's got a swing! I was a boxer back to Take Monday! The gun. Yeah, there you go. Well, you could just kick oh, it away, that's fine. You, not I like he'll wake up and pick it up again. Nope. This I didn't come by for nothing. I kinda wish I'd have brained him, though. When my boy, Razor, disappeared, I received a letter with a locker ticket inside. Inside the locker. I found this box. I do not understand what it means, 
but I think it must be a sort of message from the man who took my son from me. Cool. Should have had a daughter. Thanks. Bye. Late. You should really have picked up the gun instead of leaving it on the floor, because if you punched him hard enough to knock him out, then either he'll wake up soon or you Take killed him. See if it can be of any use to you at all. <laughs> be pretty, pretty, pretty neato if you could kill him with one hit. Right on. It will help you find the other little boy. Man, if he gets found, it's totally going to be Fatty Arbuckle that did it, because none of the other people are being fucking useful at all. You're just going to leave him? Take the gun or something? Hello? I was beginning to think that there was no good to be found in this place. What place? I leave, and then he goes over and picks up the gun and just shoots the guy. Way to go, man. Protect what's yours. The only regret I have in this game so far is that I didn't realize it was a slow prompt and I couldn't brain the guy. Hey, I'm playing as someone new! Hey, It a lady! It a lady girl. Finally, female protagonists! Her dick's over one and a half inches. I like how big this apartment is. Is she an architect? <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is giant. This woman is loaded. It is a... I think I think David Cage just makes these games because he's like, I want to make giant fucking sprawling architecture that people can walk through and appreciate. I guess I should build a story around that. <laughs> it's like Tolkien building a story as to how his language is, but way less cool. Uh, I guess I'll get up. Uh. Are these just prompts to sit in these chairs? I'm gonna sit here... And have some thoughts. I really need sleep. How hard can it be to fall asleep? It's actually pretty hard, let me tell you. Riveting next generation entertainment! <laughs> A hot drink is what I need. Man, having an apartment with a big ass step like that seems like a recipe for disaster. You get even a little drunk and you're fucking shattering your ankle right into. Are you gonna microwave old tea or coffee or whatever? Yeah. Gross. I do that all the time. Is it gonna be ready immediately, like with the pizza? Nah, this takes longer than the pizza. Gulp. Beautiful. Let's get drunk! Oh, that's water. <laughs> well, whatever. Have any fun. Placebo. Pretend it's the vodka. Maybe if I drink so much I have to pee, I'll pee out all my awakeness. I'll read magazines. Look at the pretty lady, she's so pretty. Somebody in my apartment? Awesome, I'm about to get murdered. Well, done being a lesbian. I guess I should pick up like a meat cleaver or something. Though, when you think about it, it is kind of, you know, true to life that she'd be in her underwear. Because why would guess, you wear pants at home? Since you're literally in your underwear right now. Yeah. I'm not. How the fuck do you sleep? Because like, I'm cold. Maybe the reason you can't sleep is because you don't have any blinds for your windows and there's like a huge ass light. There's someone watching me. That's why I can't sleep. Somebody's watching me. Like literally her window and to I have her no bed privacy. is right there. Oh, weirdo. Why did you buy blinds? They're too expensive. I just moved in and it was very important that I not buy blinds. I'm leaving. Oh, this is just the bathroom. Well, maybe I'll have a psycho moment and what the fuck? Did this used to be like a dormitory? Why is my sink like this? Maybe it was a fire Looks like it used to be like a school or something. Can whoever's in my apartment hurry up and murder me? No, you gotta make sure you get naked first. <sighs> gotta have a psycho moment. I can't think of music for a psycho besides It's just the... that, that string's like... <laughs> so I went Twilight Zone instead. <laughs> Whatever, you're not too far off. I like to sleep with lip gloss on, too. I like to make sure that I look banging while I sleep. It's a pill. Didn't I just say I shouldn't take a pill? Should've given me the option not to take the pill. Rude. Now I'm gonna be all drugged out when I get raped and murdered. Ugh. Yeah, mm, mm, mm. Time for boobs. 
Yeah. Mm, really? Really? Boobs, really? Yeah, I know. I told you. There were really boobs in this. <sighs> I wasn't... I wasn't exaggerating. Well, at least unlike Ellen Page, she probably consented for her boobs to be in the game. I know I like to shower like that. Pressed up against the wall. Yeah, baby. Oh, baby. <laughs> Tra la la. Singing it's like in the shower. Just took a snapshot of da, my life. Da 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 la la la. That's enough. I didn't realize you could end it. I didn't mean to just sit here watching somebody shower like a weirdo. Cool towel. Yay! So clean. That's not how you wrap towels around yourself, idiot. Oh, I guess she's drying. I see. You're not gonna do the undercarriage. Whatever. Just let it air dry, I guess. Now what? Am I putting on the same fucking underwear? What was the point, even? Gross. Could I put on just the top and then just walk around in my apartment? No bottoms. Cool, I'll just put on the same gross clothes, no problem. It's not super gross to wear the underwear you just wore before your shower. Absolutely not. To be fair, she didn't- Really? Want... Is this really necessary? What the fuck is going it's on? It's a peeing sequence. Why are, the, why are there so many peeing sequences in this John game? John Cage is super into pee. I... Maybe she's taking a dump. I can't hear if there's any sound of liquid. What? What? <laughs> she's decompressing. You didn't even wipe! Ugh! She put on- Okay, she showered and she put dirty underwear back on and then she didn't even wipe after she went to the bathroom. This woman is disgusting and she deserves to be murdered. <sighs> Somebody's been in my apartment. Oh no. Who could it be? Time to get murdered. Shouldn't yeah, I get like, you day. know, like a bottle or a knife yeah. or something? Look here, murderer, you should have closed the fridge. There's someone here. There's someone in the apartment. Oh no. Phone on the desk. I could call for help. And here I am, all fragile. The front door. It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Well, time for me to get effin' murdered. Oh, great. Can't wait. This isn't gross they at all. They must have got in while I was asleep. My cell. On the desk. I need to call for help. Whee! It's gone. Oh, darn it. I'm helpless in my underwear. Grab like the lamp or something. Come on, lady. The front door. It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Things are going great. Ow. Rude. Stop trying to kill me in my own home. It's awfully rude of you. I was to just my trying house. to sleep. Try to kill me. I'm trying to sleep. Man, it's weird that he doesn't have any legs. It's one of those legless murderers. It's just his feet and then a torso. He might have legs, but they they look like they're camouflage, so it's hard for me to tell. <laughs> Ow. What did I do? Is it just because I'm a hot lady? Whoops. Looked like he appeared on the other side awfully fast. Are there really two of them? Oh, there are! Am I like an investigative journalist who revealed something super important? You killed her! Get out of my house. Oh, there's three of them. Whoops. <laughs> I would really rather you didn't. Like, if that's okay with you. Throw the TV no, on him! Oh, come on, lady. You missed. Ow. 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 There are no prompts here, I'm just dead. Oh, hey, awesome. Awesome, go me! Stabbed them both. Oh, I locked myself in the bathroom. That seems like a bad idea. Well, at least there's like a door between us now. Oh, hey! Great. Three people. Oh, dead. Oh! It was all a dream. Yeah. Weird. Yeah. It was all a dream. Huh. Guess what? Sequence is over. I have a recurring dream of being murdered in my own apartment? Is that what's going on? Yeah, the whole thing is that she has insomnia, but honestly, like... Maybe I should now. set up... My apartment, so that in my dreams the furniture is the same as in life, and just set up like barricades. 
Well, that's all for today. We'll see you guys later when I'm effing. Yeah. My favorite.